Every local book market website comes with the ability to add unlimited pages to your business's site. In this tutorial, we're going to see exactly how easy it is to add pages and control where they show up on your site. To start out, we're going to go to the Easy Website Creator homepage and click on the Customer Login button. From there, you're going to give your email and password for signing in. And on the left side, you're going to go to the link that says Pages and click on that. Since this site we're working on is for a local coffee shop, we're going to add a menu page. To give a professional header on the top of the page, we're going to add an image. To add an image, simply click on the Upload button, and then choose the file that you want to use. We created one for the site and for this particular page called Our Menu. You can hit Our open and click send it to the server. Okay, now, now that it's been uploaded, we hit OK. And you'll see the images pop right into that text box. Now we've already built our menu in Word, so we're going to go into our Word document where we created the menu, hit select all, copy, and then come back to the page where we're going to add the text. Now it's very important that we don't just add the text straight into the page because Word sends over some odd formatting uh, things. So we're going to actually go into the particular button that says paste directly from Word. This way we don't run into any weird formatting errors. So we click that box to paste from Word and we paste the text right in. Hitting OK, you'll see that the entire menu for this coffee shop has now been pasted into the site. And you can also edit any part that you want in that text. We're going to click Save Page. And now we're going to go check out our site. You'll see that there isn't anything on the site right now that says Menu. We hit Refresh. And we'll see the menu link has been added to the top and the side navigation panels. Clicking menu, you'll see now that the entire page has been added instantaneously to your site. Now say you want the menu to show up in the top navigation panel, but you don't want it to come in the side. Simply go right back into your website manager and click on the navigation options you'll see that every new page you add will get added into the Navigation Options Control Panel. Going right here, you'll see where Menu has been highlighted. And we don't want it showing up on the side, so we hit No, and click Save My Menu Selections. Going back to the site, now you'll see that Menu is at the top of the bar, but it has been removed from the side navigation panel.